Hello, my fellow historians. It's Mr. Peter. And today, we honor someone from world history who I learned about when I visited the Philippines, an island country of Southern Asia. Jose Rizal is considered a national hero of the Philippines. He was born June 19, 1861. He was many things. He was an artist. He made paintings and sculptures. He was a naturalist. He studied science and nature. He wrote novels and poems. When his mother went blind, he studied medicine and became a doctor of the eyes. He was a teacher who worked in many places. All this he did in a very short life. For when he was 35 years old, he was arrested for protesting and killed by the Spanish government that controlled the Philippines. At that time, countries with strong armies dominated other places around the world without question. When people like Jose Rizal dared to question and speak out for the people, they were crushed. In prison, hours before his death, he wrote a poem, Mi Ultimo Adios. In English, My Last Farewell. In Tagalog, a language of the Philippines, Uling Paalam. After reading the poem, I was inspired to write a song. The song features the first stanza, or part, sung first in English, then in Tagalog, even if you don't understand all the words. You get the sense for what he was feeling in those final hours as he wrote, Mi Ultimo Adios. Those beautiful words are like a gift from the past, 
like the spirit of Jose Rizal coming to visit. There are 13 other stanzas in that poem. Perhaps you will read the rest of it someday. But for now, enjoy the rest of the program, and we'll see you next time.